Hello, welcome to Music Theory Grade 1, Week 14. Week 14, we're looking at key signatures. When we write music, which mostly uses notes from the scale of C major and sounds good finished with a C, we say that music is in the key of C major or in C major. Here's a, here's a, sh a short tune in C major. We're starting. We're starting on C and we finish on C. G major key signature. If a tune mostly uses the notes from the G major scale and sounds good finished with a G, then the music is in G major. The scale of G major contains the notes G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp. The key of, C, of G major contains F sharps not F natural. We have F sharp. Instead of writing all the Fs in the piece with sharp signs next to them, we write just one F sharp right at the beginning of the line, after the clef and before the time signature. This is called the key signature. And this is how we do it. After the clef, before the time signature. The treble clef, we always write the F sharp sign on the top line. We never use the lower F space. You should be able to just see the line of the stave between the two horizontal lines of the F sharp sign. In the bass left, we write the sign for F sharp on the second line from the top. And this is how we write it. The key signature is written at the beginning of every line of music, immediately after the left, to remind us that all the Fs need to be F sharps. We don't use a key signature for music, which is in C major, because we don't need one. C major doesn't have any sharps or flats. The key signature is there to remind us that all the Fs in the piece should be F sharps. It applies to all the pitches of F, not just the one on the top second line on the stave. Here's the same tune as the one in C major, but now it's in G major. So you can see it starts on G and it ends on G. So this is in the key of G. The D major key signature. The scale of D major has two sharps, F sharp and C sharp. This means that music written in the key of D major has F sharps and C sharps. The scale of D major has two sharps, F sharp and C sharps. This means that the music written in the key of D major has F sharp and C sharp. The key signature of D major is a, in the treble clef looks like this. This is how we have two sharps, F and C. We add the C sharp after the F sharp, that's what we've got already. In the bass clef, the key signature of D major looks like this. Still F and C, F major key signature. 
finally let's look at the key signature of f major remember that in f major there's no sharps but there is one flat which is b flat and that's how we write our b flat In the trouble curve, the flat is written uh, on the middle line. In the base curve, the flat is written on the second line from the bottom. Thank you for watching. Let's meet again next time.